Hello! For this video, I wanted to make climbing shoe bags. I feel like when you go climbing, you just kind of like stuff your shoes inside of the bag. And for me and my partner specifically, he has super sweaty feet. So when you leave the shoes inside of the bag, it, you just have like sweaty shoes. I don't know if that's TMI, but whatever. Um, yeah, so I thought it would be nice to actually put the shoes inside of a bag and then put that inside of a bag. Um, yeah, so I'm making two bags today. I will be making one for me and one for my partner, Nico. And the plan is, is to hand sew them and then to paint over them and then also to embroider on top of them as like a little extra decoration. So yeah, this is the video. <laughs> of me doing that so come along and we'll see uh what what comes what comes of it all yep okay here we go So this is the bag that I made first. I didn't know what I wanted to do here. I accidentally made a mistake where I sketched with a Sharpie and so couldn't really undo what I sketched out. So I just kind of painted it on differently. I painted two loops here instead and then just embroidered this. One of the biggest problems that I struggle with is like overthinking and kind of being a little too methodical with my my work and so I feel like when you concentrate so hard on something you can see it you can see that like you're really trying to make sure that every single little piece is in its right place and I feel like you lose a lot of character when you do that so I I don't like this side at all I feel like it's too like first of all I'm like trying to cover up the mistake that I did with the sharpie and then um and with this one, I just, I don't feel like it flows. I feel like when you, when you relax with your work, it, it flows a lot more 
naturally and it feels better and it feels like more light. When you when you focus on something too hard when you're working, you can see it. You can see that it's just like intense. So I tried on this other side, which I like this side this side a lot more. I feel like it's a little bit more chill. With this side, I decided to use an embroidery loop and I really I really like the way that it turned out. So I think for sure I will be using an embroidery loop uh, for the rest of the embroideries that I do on the other bags. Yeah, and I just kind of made it a little bit more chill and just like put little random stitches wherever. And I like it a lot more. I feel like it's, it's like less effort, more flow. Yeah, so, okay, off of camera, I made another bag and this bag will be able to fit Nico's. These, these, this bag will fit my shoes. And then I think this bag will fit Nico's shoes. Now I know kind of the size of bags that will fit like really big climbing shoes and like maybe just size 42 and a little bit smaller. So I'm going to take all the lessons that I learned from this bag and put it into this one. And hopefully I will have a kind of more relaxed, more stylized, fun, climbing shoes bag with this one so yeah okay i'm going to start sewing and painting and embroidery and we'll see how it goes Here they are. I'm really happy with the way that they turned out. I love this one so much. Look at that. Look at that. It's just flowing. It's just looking good. I really enjoy it. I think it's really cool. It turned out awesome. I'm super happy about it. And yeah, the shoes fit perfectly inside. And the other one. Try not to shake the camera. Yay! It's okay, I like it. I like it a little bit more, but I'm still I still appreciate um this one. Nico's bag a lot more. I think it's way cooler. Feet. So yeah, 
that's the story. That's what happened. Um, I really enjoy them. I think they're, they turned out really great and I'm happy to um, start making more and hopefully selling them. Uh, the goal is in the future is to be able to get a sewing machine so that I could create more uh, creations for people to sell and to, you know, uh, make other people's lives happier uh, by creating stuff that um, is pretty and will last long and will come from um, uh, recycled substances like recycled fabric or going to the thrift store and like making making new stuff for for people reusing the stuff that we have on this earth already um yeah so that's it i hope you enjoyed it and please like and subscribe uh and yeah we'll see you in the next video goodbye